good morning. Today is the day. I'm gonna go and take a shower. Okay, okay, okay. So this is it. Um, it's already almost 6 a.m. I have to meet with the driver downstairs. Um, I'm ready. So let's do it. Right here. Here we are. Yep. Nobody hooked me up. Oh, I'm not going anywhere with this. It's not that painful though. So I'm here with the dad. He already made my consultation and we agree on what I'm gonna get done. So stay tuned. Time for me to change. Okay, so I already changed. I already spoke with the anesthesiology and complete a bunch of paperwork and nothing. Stay tuned. Hey, you could have done. Good luck with everything. Thank you. Am I leaving already? Are we leaving? Yes. Oh, I'm leaving. Okay, bye. Okay, so this is it. I am back into my bed. My room. They are me in at 8.10. And it is already 11.10. Something like that. A.M. This is some ice. This is some ice. I don't feel nothing other than my mouth, like a, my throat. And I don't see no big difference. I don't know. Kind of concern. Let's see, this shit is gonna turn. He didn't use no rib cutter because I don't have no incision here, nothing. So I don't know. Not my ears. So how the hell he use? I don't know. How he keep the bridge and the tip of the nose to get us stay there. I don't have a clue. Hopefully this shit turns good. <clears throat> My throat is killing me. That is the only thing. I wanna see pictures. And I don't feel nothing, I feel good. <clears throat> Other than my throat. So yep. Stay tuned. Okay, so it's been already two hours that I've been out of surgery. I'm not sleepy. And I actually want to go to sleep because I want to rest. But I'm not sleepy, so yeah. Hey. Um, this is a nice pad that is already melted, though. I don't know how I'm gonna go, but the curiosity is gonna kill me. I'm waiting for those pictures that they're gonna send me when I was on the table to see how I actually look because I'm so curious right now. Uh, I've been on my phone, I'm not in pain. My GP nose is numb right now. I'm thirsty. I cannot eat after two hours. I had something here. Look a little bone. You see? 
when I got out of surgery, I feel my throat hurt. I don't know if they put something through my mouth. But yeah, that's what it is. Uh, they unhooked me from that thing. I have an ID. But they took it out like 30 minutes after I got out. So, well, they got me. Ooh. Let's see what they get. Can I actually? I don't even know. I got out at 11, 12, 1. So they didn't wait two hours. I think that I can eat, no? <laughs> okay. Oh my god, this. How half of this place is still here? I don't have a seat because. Like, come on. Okay, where is the food? Is that the food? Salad? Yum. Soup. I can go for the soup. Let's see. That's the view from my room. And I want to change my clothes. I don't want to keep with these clothes. I don't like to keep medical clothes. I want to put it on my clothes. But there's a problem. <laughs> I'm locked into this thing. I don't even know how to take that thing down. I feel like I'm in a baby crib right now. Yay! I don't even know if I mentioned before that I came over here by myself. So yeah. I don't have nobody over here to be helping me other than the nurse, of course. Um, and I see many people here getting the same procedure as me. And they were the family members friends or whatever <laughs> i feel like a a little dog you know those ones that don't have nobody <laughs> anyway let's see how this soup tastes okay uh, let's see this one is super big though doesn't taste like nothing, Jesus Christ. That's not the type of food that I was expecting, at least a soup with a little bit of salt in it. Doesn't taste like nothing, but at least it's something to go through my... Uh, throw, because kind of... It's not hair, it's real uncomfortable my throat. But that's enough. I'm getting to that. And what is this yoga? Let's give it a try. I need like water. That's what I need. Well, oh, I don't have any other spoon, so. My throat is killing me. Mm. The little corners of the yoga, it feels good. Okay, that's enough. Uh, no. I'm not gonna keep eating, I feel like a on the inside, you know, like when something's gonna come out of your nose, yeah. So we just better leave it like that. I'm not even hungry right now. I just need to use the bathroom. I need to find a way how to get out of this place. Okay, I already. <laughs> Jesus, I look. <laughs> she looks funny. I went for my fair walk, and. It was not a long walk though, it was like a less than one minute walk. And I was able to go to the bathroom two hours and was it like three hours after the surgery or two hours, 45 minutes after the surgery. I stood up and I went to the bathroom and I went for a little walk, less than one minute. I sipped a little bit of water because I really needed it. And they gave me another 
iPad and they changed the the thing. It's full of blood. I have a video how I look after. I mean, when they remove this thing, how I look. Ooh, yeah, baby. Okay, so here is 4, 16 p.m. Uh, the doctor came back to talk to me. I have a question because I was, <laughs> I was like, uh, I've been doing a lot of research, like I said before, and I was wondering what he used to build my bridge, the bridge of my nose. And because I was suspecting that he would have to use my ribs. And way before the surgery he said that he wouldn't know until he opened up my nose to find out what's going on so at the end of the day he used my own cartilage cartilage whatever from my nose to build the tip of my nose so yeah i was like what where can i have enough to do that <laughs> um so yeah this is it this is it this is it this is it he gave me some instructions he's not gonna be uh, here when i leave tomorrow but you know the, the team of the nurse uh, they're gonna be around and they're gonna be here to tell me what about then tomorrow and what else i'm not hungry at all i hasn't asleep at all I honestly thought that i was gonna be able to rest to be knocked out like i'm you know, finally sleep and blah blah blah. Uh, nope. Not sleepy. It's only four something PM and I'm not sleepy. I should go to sleep. I don't know what's going on. Okay, so let's give it a try again to this soup. Because it is already four thirty PM and I hasn't eaten nothing. And it's not that I'm hungry though. But it is so bad <laughs> I like salt in my food that's what it is but you know what right now it feels way better because I don't have this sensation like it's gonna go to my nose when I swallow I don't know if you get what I'm saying but yeah And the pain that I have here, which I'm assuming is because I, I might have a tooth. That's what I'm assuming. Uh, but my friend as well, she has the same pain. So it's be, I'm assuming it's because we have like a tooth to breathe. And like it feels way better now. It doesn't feel comfortable. more soft so yeah I can't wait to see uh, let's try some solid food let's try the salad thingy thing let's start with the uh, okay let's see how we can do this okay let's try the chicken See, I can breathe through my nose. The chicken is better. How good I eat this chicken. Uh. <clears throat> I want to go to eat a little piece. That's too hard. It's not that you cannot swallow, it's just that the chicken is hard, you have to chew it a lot. Um, I prefer water. The view from my room. Yep. And I'm going to see if I can watch some TV because I'm super bored right now. And oh, let me give you a tour of the bed. <clears throat> so 
so a little sure i must make that turn into a bed because if you have a a person that is gonna be here with you then the person can sleep there while you are there blah 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 then the tv and there's like a little closet here yeah Uh, that's the control where you can call the nurse which is so convenient for me because I don't have nobody with me like I travel by myself I don't I didn't keep with a companion and there's a bathroom sink and a shower I like that I have a shower at least uh, let's see if they might have towels here nope the top. But I'm assuming maybe if we ask them, they can get some towel. I don't know, I'm just saying. But the doctor said not to take a shower. Uh, I don't remember what he said. He said today, and I don't know if he said for the next three days or something like that. I'm gonna ask one of the nurse later. Also, the room have a mini fridge. Well, hello again. It is 5.35 p.m. They brought me dinner already. Yeah. Yeah. But the dinner... It's <laughs> same as breakfast. Yogurt. The same soup. And... I don't know what. It's like a... a some and some rice and a bread so i guess i'm gonna give it a little try to the other mini soup <laughs> to see how it goes um i'm not hungry though i don't have nothing like i'm again not in pain not in not sleepy but i want to sleep but i'm not sleepy yeah and right now, the one of the nurse came by, took away whatever thing that I had there. And I asked if I could ch change this thing. They say yes. So I'm going to put it on one of my eyes. The thing is that my share have a message there. that I, It's like a root message share. And I don't want, I don't want to be able to. I mean, it's not that they all of them speak English, but, uh, but whatever. I'm gonna change this. Well, but another one. Did I have to use that one? I cannot smile. Did I try to? I got stitches all the way here. And over here, and over here as well. Has some, I don't know, things inside my nose as well. And yeah. I was aware of that, that that's going to happen because I have a big uh, <coughs> and that's not an issue for me. If anything, I just get lips filler. Yep, I just leave it like that because it doesn't bother me. Well, actually, bother me was my nose. So, yeah. Well, it's 8 10 p.m. right now one of the nurse came and hooked me up yeah to one of these things and he said that uh, in 10 minutes it's gonna be back um <sighs> he also rinsed my nose they get what experience <laughs> um with that syringe he put like solid water both sides it, it drip of course 
but it went to my throat and make me cough. Uh, it's a little bit uncomfortable, not the end of the world, but a little bit uncomfortable. He changed my teeth and gave me instructions how to do it if I wanted to do it and leave some of those things here. Uh, pretty much that's it. I think that I'm going to take a nap, finally. I have a little headache, a little. From 1 to 10, I would say it's like a, a 3 or 2 and a half, something like that. But I have a headache. Uh, I'm gonna try to sleep, maybe that's what I need. And I was reading the instructions, and of course, I was supposed to be resting and da da da, but I was not as sleepy. So I'm gonna try to sleep now. Last update for the day. Uh, over here is already 10 37 p.m. I took a little nap from like 9 something. One hour nap, actually. Uh, right now, I woke up because I, I felt so my back was in pain. I was uncomfortable on the bed because the bed had to be 30 degrees angle. So now I have this idea. I'm putting this blanket here in my bag so I can lay down back again. Before that, I went to sleep. I was using the ice pad in my eyes and in my forehead, actually. And it helps. It was really nice to have it up. Still, I'm not in pain. You know, related with the nose job or nothing like that. The headache that I had earlier is just went away. After the nap, maybe I just have to rest, of course. That's what it is. And. So no pain, no hungriness, no, I sleep easily, uh, I'm gonna try to go back to sleep though. <clears throat> so that's it, oh for the day, day number two, and another thing, I don't know if you can notice, but I am not sore, like, maybe a little bit on this side. My eyes, no, 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 so no, at all. And the bump that I have earlier pretty much went away. And I can, my lips on the top, it feels fine. I, at the beginning, I feel kind of numb, but that's it. I hate looking at my la belleza. <laughs> and thank you for watching subscribe like and share bye